hello everyone and welcome back into my second lecture of the vector calculus okay so we are discussing the questions on vector calculus from the mathematics second semester vtu for the cse and allied branches so bmat s201 is the subject code last problem we have solved uh, we were supposed to calculate only grade 5 in this uh, question uh, one extra thing is there that is magnitude of grad 5 okay later on we will see how to calculate the magnitude of uh, grad 5 over there first of all as we already know we have the uh, formula that is del phi is equal to dou phi upon dou x i cap plus dou phi divided by dou y j cap plus dou phi divided by dou z k cap okay so in the previous video i have told you what does this uh, dou phi mean it is the vector quantity so we are uh, supposed to calculate this one it is also called as grade phi at these points one comma minus two comma minus one okay so phi function is given and we have to calculate the magnitude of grade phi right so <clears throat> i will just put the phi value in this particular equation that is del phi is equal to dou by dou x of instead of this phi we have the value here 3x square y minus y cube z square okay 3x square y minus y cube z square i cap plus dou divided by dou y we have phi here so uh, put down the phi value same as it is then dou by dou z of same phi value okay 3x square y plus uh, sorry minus y cube z square k cap so this is the equation now we have to partially differentiate it dou phi is equal to see here <coughs> this is the x term and y term is here when we are differentiating this term so y is constant with respect to this x okay so y uh, keep this uh, y as it is so differentiation of x will happen so three twos are six so six x y will be the differentiation for this one okay so this is the basic differentiation i am assuming that you are having the hold on the differentiation part if you are uh, weak in the differentiation part you can uh, tell in tell me in the comment section so that i can make the separate basic video for the differentiation over there so minus uh, this one y cube z square so here x term is not present so differentiation of this term will be definitely zero just because we are differentiating with respect to x so here is uh, in the absence of x the differentiation is zero so multiplied by i cap plus here you can see here uh, y is present we are differentiating with respect to y so x is constant with respect to y so we can write it as 3x square differentiation of y is 1 with respect to y okay so 3x square multiplied by 1 will be 3x square minus so here we have y cube z square we are differentiating it with, with with respect to y so power down and minus one okay so three y square will be the differentiation for this so three y square and z is constant with respect to y so z square is as it is j cap plus see here x square y we are differentiating with respect to z so no z term is in this particular term so differentiation will be definitely zero for this term right minus y cube z square so y cube as it is as it is the uh, constant with respect to dou z so why keep uh, this y cube as it is and the differentiation of z will be sorry z square will be 2z so 2 y cube and z will, the, will be the differentiation of this term multiplied by k cap i hope you are getting my points so delta phi we are uh, we are supposed to calculate this at this particular value is 1 minus 2 minus 1 so uh, del phi at 1 comma minus 2 comma minus 1 these are x y and z values put down the values now 6 multiplied by x value is 1 6 multiplied by 1 and y value is minus 2 multiplied by minus 2 i cap okay plus 3 into x is one value so 3 1 square minus 3 into y value is minus 2 so minus 2 whole square z value is minus 1 so minus 1 whole square j cap plus this is uh, your minus 2 times y value is minus 2 so minus 2 cube into z value is minus 1 uh, into k cap right so this will become 6 into 2 that is minus 12 i cap see here 3 into 1 is 3 minus 2 2s are 4 and uh, minus and minus will become positive value right sorry this is your uh, positive value that is 4 into 1 is 4 4 multiplied by 3 is 12 that is minus 12 plus, uh, plus 3 okay that will be your minus 9 uh, j cap right then this is your minus 2 this is your minus 2 cube so this will become 8 8 into 2 is 16 and this is also minus over here okay minus and minus and minus will become your minus also uh, i hope you are getting this is minus and minus will be plus plus into minus minus so minus 16 so minus 16 k cap over here i hope you can calculate these terms it's a very simpler part calculation part is yours so this becomes your del phi at these particular three points then we are supposed to calculate the magnitude of grade phi this is the grade phi now we have to calculate the magnitude 
okay so magnitude of delphi is always equal to under root of uh, this one uh, this square and this square and this square means a square b square plus c square whatever the terms are with the unit vectors you have to take them with the whole square so minus 12 whole square plus this minus 9 whole square plus this minus 16 whole square once you calculate it you will get 21.9317 this is the answer for your magnitude of grad phi i hope uh, this question is clear to you people so make sure you will share this video to all your friends and thanks for watching the video